Hi friends, I'm Likita H. In this video, we're going to see how to connect the state of common anode RGB LED. And we're going to see how to blink it with different colors. And also we're going to see how to generate different shades of light using RGB LED, which stands for red, green and blue. Let's go for it. The materials required for this experiment are a breadboard, Arduino Uno board, a USB cable, few jumper wires, 3 220 ohm resistor and RGB LED. Now we'll see the schematic diagram of how to connect them into the circuit. This is the schematic diagram of common anode RGB LED. These are the four legs of the RGB LED. This one represents R which means red. Just beside the red there is a common anode terminal. This one is the green and this one is the blue. Now let's see how common anode terminal is formed. This is the red and this is the green and this is the blue. All these anodes form the common anode terminal. The common anode terminal comes out like this. Now we have seen the schematic diagram of see how common anode terminal is formed. Let's see how to connect them into the circuit. Now let's start building the circuit. I'm taking the RGB LED and connecting it to random columns. I'm taking the 220 ohm resistor and connecting it to the first leg of the RGB LED. I'm, ta I'm taking a jumper wire and connecting it to the second leg of the resistor, 220 ohm resistor. And connecting the other end of the jumper wire. To any pin, I am connecting it to pin number 2. Next, I am taking a jumper wire and connecting it to the second leg of the RGB LED. And the other end of jumper wire, I am connecting it to 5 volt power source. Next, again I am taking a 220 ohm resistor and connecting it to the third leg of the RGB LED the other leg of the resistor to random column. I am taking a jumper wire and connecting it to the second leg of the resistor, 220 ohm resistor and the other end of jumper wire I am connecting it to digital pin number 4. I am taking a 220 ohm resistor and connecting it to the fourth leg of the RGB LED. Next, I am taking a jumper wire and connecting it to the second leg of the resistor, of 220 ohm resistor and the other end of the and the other end of jumper wire, I am connecting it to a digital pin 6. I am connecting the computer to Arduino board using USB cable. And there we go, the happy little noise. Now we have completed building the circuit. Let's make it work. I'm going to the Arduino Uno IDE. Now let's start the code. I'm creating a variable. I'm writing int. And then the way I am naming the variable as red pin which is equals to pin number 2 and ending it with a semicolon. I am taking another variable and naming it as green pin which is equals to pin number 4. So I am writing pin number 4 and then again I am creating a variable for the blue pin. I am naming it as blue pin and it is connected to pin number 6. So I am writing pin number 6. The variable part is completed. Let's come to the void setup. In the void setup, I'm writing pin mode with M uppercase and within a bracket, I'm writing red pin and it is an output. So I'm writing output with all uppercase and ending with it with a semicolon. I'm doing the same for the green pin and blue pin. So I'll just copy it by control C and I'll come down over here and control V. Let's make it as green pin. I'm doing the same for the blue pin. So I'll just control V and then I'm naming it as 
blue pen. The void setup is completed. Let's come to the void loop now. Over here, I'm writing digital write with W uppercase. And within a bracket, I'm writing the variable which is red pin. And we want it to on first. So I'm writing high with all uppercase. And next, let's take a delay. And I'm making it as 1000 mil. And I'm making it as 1000 milliseconds. I'm taking another digital write with W uppercase. And then I'm taking the red pin and as low this time and ending it with a semicolon let's take another delay and i'm writing 1000 milliseconds and ending it with a semicolon let's just copy it Control c and then Control v and over here it's the green pin and let's come down again And in control V and over here let's make it as blue pin the code is completed now let's verify it and it's saying green pin is not was not declared so over here, I did a spelling mistake. I wrote green pin instead of green pin. So let me make it as green pin. Let's verify it. And now let's upload it. An error occurred while uploading the sketch. Can't open device com3. The system cannot find the file specified. Okay, so now we have not connected the USB cable properly. So let's just connect it. And then let's upload it. And there we go, it's blinking. See now the blue, white, red, green. Let's alter the timing now. This thousand milliseconds, let's make it as 500 milliseconds. Let's make it a bit fast. This is again 500. 500. 500. 500 and the last one five 500 so let's verify it and now let's upload it there we go it's blinking so fast now let's see how fast it will blink when it when it's at 100 milliseconds let's change it to 100 Let me verify it and now I'll upload it. And there we go, it's so far. Now let's see it in the other way. Over here, digital write red pin high. Let's make it as a number. Let's make it as 50. And rest everything as zero. Let's delete this when we said low. And over here, let's make it as zero. And let's Delete this zero and now let's delete this. Let's delete all the delays. Over here also let's delete all the delays and over here also. So now let's verify it. And now let's upload it. Over, over here in the red pin, let's make it as 50. And let's upload it. And there we go. A single color. A blue color is on. So which means over here, the blue color is pin number 2. So let's change it to pin number 2. And the red pin is pin number 4. So let's change it to pin number 4. And now let's upload it. And let's see which color. There we go. The red LED is on. Now let's make the red LED as 0. And let's make the green... And pin as 50 and now let's upload it and there we go the green LED is on let's do the same for the blue pin 
I'm making it as 50 and now let's upload it. There we go, the blue pen is on now. So now, why only we should make it as 50? Now let's try it as 20 for the same blue pin. Can you guys see over here? It is less intensity now. Okay, so now let's make this as 20, the green pin as 20 and now let's upload it. And there we go now, the green one is at less intensity. In this way, we can make different shades of color. Thank you friends. Please do like, share, subscribe and comment. Bye-bye.